Hey, hey, happy, what is today? Thursday. <laughs> happy Thursday, everyone. Oh my goodness. So I just wanted to hop on here, um, as I normally do, to talk about something that is really important, I think, for all of us to know. I think we put a lot of pressure on ourselves to find our calling, to find like what were we put on this earth for. Um, in terms of what is the job that I need? Am I meant to be an accountant? Am I meant to be a fireman? Am I meant to be a stay-at-home mom? You know, what is my calling? And I hear this all the time, this like confusion around what is the place, the one place, the one job, the one position, the one business that I should have so that I can be happy. And I think we've got it all wrong. I don't think that that's how, you know, this works. I don't think that's how life works. I don't think that's how life is supposed to work. And I was, I was on my way home from the airport um, on Tuesday, and I was talking to my partner about how, I was talking to him about a current client, and I was talking to him about how soulmates, it's the same thing. We as a society have this belief that there's one true person with this one true position or job, this one true thing that is written in our, you know, on our soul's DNA, you know, transcript, whatever, that says, if you find me, if you find this thing, that you will be happy. And, you know, I'm a believer in the, that um, there, you know, there's this, there's this theory. Let's say that there's this theory that in the soulmates world, right, that there is a soulmate, multiple soulmates for every person, and that there's a soulmate for each period of a person's life. So there's the high school sweetheart. There's the college. You know, there's the, you know, from X age to X age. Then there's the person that you end up spending the majority of your life with, and. I don't think that that person that you die with, right, who you spend the rest of your life with, is necessarily your one truest soulmate. What about all of the souls that you've been entwined with, that you've learned something very important from, that have gotten you to this place? And so I'm a firm believer in terms of, now I don't know about the, the romance stuff, you're going to have to talk to a relationship coach about that, but I'm a firm believer that in terms of your career, in terms of your calling and your purpose, there is a job out there. There is a business out there. There is a money-making tool out there that is destined for you in this moment in time. And there was one destined for you in high school. And there was one destined for you in college. And there's one destined for you in the future. And our job is to figure out where, you know, where we are in that path and what job what business, what career is meant for us right now? So, you know, rather than say, what, what am I supposed to do with my life? What is my calling? You can say, what is my purpose right now? What is my calling right now? And I keep using those words interchangeably, but I actually might want to say that they're different. You know, calling is a job. Calling is a position as a business, right? I think your purpose, why are you on this planet? I think that stays the same. So, you know, my purpose might be, you know, I always think that the purpose is more vague. So your purpose might be to help people. That might just be a general purpose or to help women or to, um, you know, work with math to solve, you know, some of the world's biggest problems, right? But your calling can change. See how that can be, you know, work with math to solve some of the world's greatest problems could be your purpose while you're on this earth. But you could apply that purpose to many callings. You know, you can be a scientist for NASA. You could be, you know, an entrepreneur, solopreneur, solving some crazy problem that requires math. You know, you could be um, working for a large financial institution, right? So there's all these different callings that fit this one true purpose. So what I would challenge you to do is not, is to take the pressure off and not say, what is my calling? What is the job position? 
you know, career path, business that I need to take to be happy, you know, I would challenge you to say, what is my purpose? Why was I put on this earth? What do I uniquely have that can contribute to the world? And what are the series of things that I have that I can contribute to the world? And with those tools and that, that mindset, think, wow, look at all the opportunities that I have to fulfill my, my purpose. Look at all these opportunities for callings, my options. I have a menu. It's not pre, you know, predestined. You have choice. There's free will in this. Based on my purpose, what can I do to change the world? And, you know, that is why I don't believe there is one true calling. I believe there are many true callings. So let's take the pressure off. Let's stop worrying. There is a path. We have a job, a position, a business for each, you know, moment in our life. And it's okay if we shift. And it's okay if we stay. But it's not okay to stay if you're going against your purpose. Why you're here. Okay, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Carly Myers. I'm the founder and coach at Work You Love. You can visit me at workyoulovenow.com. Um, if you feel like you're struggling with this, you feel like the pressure has been on your shoulders, that you're struggling with, okay, well, how do I do, you know, how do I fulfill my soul's purpose and make money the whole nine yards? It's time to talk, absolutely. Um, if you visit my website, workyoulovenow.com, you can find at the very bottom of the page um, a calendar to sign up for a complimentary consultation with me and I'll help you figure out what that purpose is because um, I know it can be difficult and the pressure can be debilitating. So um, again, I'm Carly Myers. I'm the founder of Work You Love and I hope you guys are enjoying your Thursday and I hope that this video uh, or blog post if you're reading the transcript uh, is helpful. Okay, see you guys soon.